What the f- Are you serious? I am literally shitting, crying, and throwing up. Whoa, 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 wait. Shitting, crying, and throwing up at the same time? That's crazy, bro. But I digress. Literally shitting, crying, and throwing up at the disgusting act of hate that was put on full display on the streets of Florida yesterday. And I, along with every single American, should speak up and demand that Joe Biden condemn his supporter who is an open neo-Nazi. Every single Joe Biden supporter should also be coming out to condemn the Nazis in their ranks. Silence, after all, is complicity, as they say. But in all seriousness, a couple of jabronis wearing swastikas who have definitely never spoken to a federal agent in their entire lives decided to have a parade on the streets of Florida yesterday. And every time that 12 people who are probably federal agents do something like this, you see a million headlines out of the corporate media blaming it on Republicans. But as I'm sure wow. you'll be shocked to know, the corporate media is lying. And they're lying once again. Listen to the head honcho of the Nazi parade yesterday, who again has definitely never been a federal informant in his entire life, explain why he actually supports Joe Biden in 2024. There's a presidential race going on right now. Are you going to vote in 2024? What do you think is going to happen? My vote is useless. I think Biden's better than Trump because he sends rockets to Ukraine. There you have it, folks. The Nazis are supporting Joe Biden because he is arming Ukraine. Now, why would they be doing that, you may ask? Well, there was another Nazi individual who was also attending this protest. The dude with all the weird face tattoos. And it turns out that that guy was an American volunteer for the Azov Battalion in Ukraine. In case wow. you weren't aware, a neo-Nazi organization is literally a part of the National Guard of Ukraine. It was formed after the U.S.-backed coup against the Ukrainian government in 2014, and they are literally open Nazis who also committed war crimes against native Russians in the Donbass. And the Florida Nazis are supporting Joe Biden because he's arming the Ukrainian Nazis. To be Biden supporters, are you going to condemn these neo-Nazis that are on your side? After all, white nationalist Richard Spencer also voted for Joe Biden in 2020. There is literally a pattern of white nationalists voting for Joe Biden. If Joe Biden does not condemn it immediately, he is telling all of America that he's perfectly okay with it. That's how it works, after all. Now, after watching this video, it ain't crazy to you that these people never get charged with, like, gang stuff and being called a gang? And I find it funny that every time something like this goes on, they automatically default and say it was the Republicans. Every time. And it's crazy, though, because it's always the left saying it's the right. It's the it's the right saying that it's the left. And it's the left saying, oh, it's the Republicans doing this and they're that. And then it's the, the right saying that, oh, it's the Democrats that are dumb and they're doing this. It's all over the place. But with this right here, uh, you leftists, y'all can't say nothing because this was y'all. And then it's crazy because they said they only backing Joe Biden because of his involvement with the Ukraine and what he's doing for the Ukraine. That's very telling, but it is what it is. I want to know what y'all think, man. Drop it in the comments.